Hello everyone, I am Durgesh Sahani and creating tutorial for CRUD database of operations using PDO. So in the last session we have seen how to edit or how to modify the records by using PDO. In this tutorial we will see how to delete the record. So this is the last operation. Uh, let's see the code. So what we want to do, uh, same like edit we will show one delete button. So edit and uh, once anyone click on that delete so it should go to that action.php again and delete the record come back here and remove that item from here so this is what the target is so let's go and do the code so just copy this thing and paste it here now rename this function name delete book and we don't want all the data here what just we want is id id is sufficient for deleting so we will pass one parameter here uh, which is and we will re rename it to delete now we have to create one more function just come here and say function delete book and here we will get the id now what we have to do just we want this thing and in th now we'll say just id or just just say bid and make it here bid so now we have that the hidden field have the id and we can we can create one more button over here for delete copy this one and paste it make it delete value delete initially it will be hidden same like that and once user click on the delete button uh, delete link they should be shown and these two should be hidden so come here and copy these two buttons delete this one should be none or this is already none so no need to make any changes insert should be none and this one should be blocked so if you go here just refresh now we have delete button if you click here okay it is showing update button it should not show update button should be none oh I guess it was showing correctly but we have not renamed this thing so that's why anyway delete now if you go there again and refresh it if you click on delete here you have delete button just you have to submit the or uh, what we can do to make more generic what we will do we will do the same thing like uh, update so we'll pass data okay. from here we'll pass data this one over here and Actually, we can create a function, separate function, uh, as th these data are getting duplicated. So, but for now, I'm just copying, pasting, duplicate code. Now, if we go here again, refresh. If you click on delete button, so it should show all the records over here. Okay, 
okay so here this should be book here and now this button is delete once you click on delete button it should go there and delete all the records and after deleting it should come here and uh, this should be updated so let's go we have to do the same thing go to the book.php and we have to write a function for delete name it delete and delete from table where id is equal to this id and all things we can remove from here only we require id so and execute same thing go to the action and add one more case over here this one will be delete we want only id nothing else call the delete function and here again delete delete so again we have to modify this thing this will become delete deleted successfully or something went wrong or like this we can just say while deleting here while updating and while inserting okay so let's check now just refresh click on this link if you click on delete okay so we are getting some error let me check action delete here we have created delete function function delete undefined method delete same like update we have made delete public function delete okay so problem is here we need to give a space now go back again just refresh if you click here you got all the records once you click delete you can see record is deleted if i click here press delete record is deleted you can check on database as well all the records are gone again you can so what we have created here is this we have selected this book name book type number of pages price author insert and you can see here 
record is inserted successfully if you click on edit button i just want to update my name just update here you can see updated and delete data is deleted successfully so this is what the crud operation uh, how it work in php by using pdo so uh, this is end so we are done with the tutorials for crud database operations uh, i'll update these codes uh, somewhere and i'll give you the link to the youtube channel thank you very much guys for watching if you like my videos please don't forget to subscribe thank you